Hi, everybody. This is Dr. Preeti Kachari. I am a neurologist and neurosurgeon for the past 45 years, and I am now a resilience coach. Over the years, I've helped thousands of patients in spite of disability or a limitation, because neurology is associated with a lot of disability, to recover and have a good quality of life and continue living despite this. I myself have had some challenges which I have overcome, which I believe I could do because of various lessons learned through school, through family, through friends, through teachers, and on my own attitude towards life, which taught me resilience. What is resilience? Resilience is first and foremost, the ability to keep bouncing back whenever you have a setback, converting your setbacks into stepping stones, making the comeback better than the setback, adapting to change, and very importantly, continuing to push through no matter what, in spite of limitations or adversity. Now, in my resilience coaching module, I will be doing a series of masterclasses. The masterclasses will be for one hour per class, and they will be on each single skill that you need to have in order to develop resilience. Now, fortunately, resilience is a skill which can be learned, which can be taught. But like any learning, it requires to be implemented. It requires to be repetitively, repetitively practiced. And it requires us to keep applying it in every aspect of our life as often, in fact, ideally, every single day. Because in learning, there is something known as the compounding effect. Now, if, according to Jack Fan Canfield, if you walk 20 minutes a day, you end up walking 121 miles in a year. And if you just increase by two minutes in a week, you will end up actually adding another 12 minutes, uh, 12 miles, sorry, to the entire period of duration of walking. So Atomic Habits by James Clear also says little, little changes that we make on a daily basis will impact our lives better. 